Hey guys, welcome to our new video. We hope you're safe and well. It looks like Linux Mint and Pepper and OS teams work together on a specific project. Stay with us. The Linux Mint team recently published their monthly news article. This time around it was the August 2020 edition. The article reads that the Linux Mint team has started a project called Web App Manager. They say it's the project based on the tool called ICE, which has been developed by the Peppermint OS team. So now we have to remind ourselves what the ICE is. We have already spoken about the ICE application in our previous videos. ICE SSB, which stands for ICE Site Specific Browser, is an application that integrates online applications into your menus. To put it simply, the ICE tool converts online apps into the local menu, so they open in a simplified browser window and behave like locally installed apps. In this way, you can easily launch your favorite websites and have them run in their window as if they were your desktop apps. Now the Linux Mint team say they started talks with Peppermint and are currently trying to figure out the best way to work together. In Linux Mint the tool is now called Web App Manager and they also provided a link where you can track how their work progress. They say they started a project called Web App Manager with features including a new icon and generic name, a new user interface, 100% back and forth compatibility with ICE, icon theme support with icons automatically guessed for popular websites, improved favicon downloads and so on. How it works you can find detailed description on the Linux Mint team blog page. They say users can try the Web App Manager and is available as a beta version. It's almost feature complete but isn't yet fully translated. Of course, even though the Web App Manager is in beta, we have decided to give it a try. We have downloaded the installation .deb file following the link provided by the Linux Mint team. Then we installed it via GDB package installer. The web app manager didn't want to add web apps we wish to create. For instance, it did not want to create a web app for the BBC News site, which we regularly do in the Peppermint OS's ICE application. However, it did install the services such as Google or Google Translate, Twitter and YouTube. All you need to do is to type in the web address of the site you want to make a local app for and its name and then the web app manager application will automatically find the appropriate icon online. If not, you just click the small icon on the right hand side of the address bar and the app will find it. Then you need to choose the category in your menu where you want to have the web app and choose the browser in which the site will be open as a local app. And that's it. Your favorite websites will now behave as locally installed applications and you can even use them in Alt plus Tabs feature. What's more, you can even pin the web app to the panel or the taskbar for quick access. In our experience so far, the web app manager is in beta right now, but it's rather stable to use. All in all, the web app manager allows a user to integrate her or his favorite websites into the application menu where the user can search for them just as she or he would search for any other application. Blinks means web app manager looks like an exciting idea and a very handy application. We believe it would be a good idea for Linux Mint and Peppermint OS teams to continue their cooperation beyond this project. What's your opinion on the Web App Manager? Tell us in the comment section down below. We hope you've liked the video. 
Also, tell us what you would like to see in our next videos. Thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. See you next time.